In this tutorial, I guide you through setting up a Canary release with Amazon API Gateway, an essential technique for minimizing risk and ensuring a smooth deployment of API configuration updates. It's important to note that API Gateway Canary releases should be used only for API configuration changes and not for code changes, as the API Gateway often does not have control over the underlying code execution. If you do not have a project to work with, install the API Gateway to Amazon DynamoDB project by following the QR code. After you have installed the application, navigate to the Stages section, choose the desired stage, and click on the Canary tab. Canary releases require two stages, one for the Canary release and another for the production stage. Click Create Canary to create the Canary stage used in traffic shifting. Next, define the percentage of traffic to be routed to the Canary release. Monitoring the performance of your Canary release is crucial. Go to the Logs Tracing tab within the Stage settings and enable CloudWatch Logs and AWS X-Ray Tracing. This provides valuable insights to your API's performance and helps detect potential issues early on. Once the Canary and monitoring are configured, it is time to deploy a new version of the API Gateway. Navigate to the Resources section, click on the Actions dropdown, and choose Deploy API. For the stage, choose the stage with the Canary enabled and click Deploy. With the new deployment in place, Thoroughly test the Canary release to ensure it functions as expected. Use tools like Postman, Artillery, or custom scripts to send requests to your API. Monitor key performance indicators such as response times, error rates, and latency. Keep an eye on the CloudWatch logs and X-ray data to spot anomalies or issues. When ready to fully deploy the changes, navigate to the Canary Release tab and click Promote Canary to Production merging the Canary release with the production stage, making the new configuration updates available to all users.